Alright, so now we have Blender open again. Go to and the tools. Stop throwing it over there. Go to where you have your uh, PMX model and import model. All right, so this time around it did work. Let me turn on the screencast. All right, so we don't need the cube. We can get rid of the cube. The camera, don't need the camera or that one, which they put in like that for some reason. All right, so now we have our model. If you press uh, set, go to the material, and you're going to notice it fits pink. In order to get rid of that, you're going to press right in the second tab down here. First of all, select your model and turn off the tune texture and now you see her as um that's sort of real texture should be um one other thing you can select the individual items you have more clothings so in order to do that we go back to the MMD tab and we're gonna press this one separate by materials so now after that's done every single individual item has been separated So now we're in here. Now let's create. All right. So one other thing that I like to do from uh, this point, um, you, just to keep myself organized, I like to separate the model on their individual sections. So let's call this one. Uh, Head. You're gonna put everything that belongs to the head there. You're gonna be putting here everything that's in the body. If I can actually spell. And let's select clothing. Here we're gonna put the bones, and lastly, the annoying ones is that they're rigid bodies. All right. So, in order to move things around, you can select an item, press M, and select your new collection. So this one's going to go to the bones. So now they got transfer in the bone systems. You can turn them off and now that's gone. So that, I'm also putting that in the same spot. Let's move those into the body section. You can turn that off. And that, that goes into the body and body as well now what's left is the head you can turn that off and then we turn everything on and off this guy appears which is all the uh, rigid bodies and this is the reason why I separated them because if you don't, this thing's going to be obviously getting in the way. 
So now we move that one to our rigid bodies. And pretty much that's always going to be hidden. Alright, so we have our model. At this point, I would like to have a save. And let's call this one Puroko. Puroko test. Save. Okay, so we have our model party, we have our materials separated. 